Welcome back to Z Coins World, the place where we uncover the hidden treasures in your everyday pocket change. Today, we're diving into the intriguing world of the 1978 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny. You might be asking, what makes this particular penny so special? Well, let's break it down. The 1978 Lincoln Penny without a mint mark was struck at the Philadelphia Mint. While most of these pennies are common, there are certain factors that can make some of them exceptionally valuable. First, let's talk about condition. The value of a coin can skyrocket if it's in pristine condition, especially if it has been graded by a professional grading service like PCGS or NGC. A 1978 penny in mint state, with no wear and tear, can fetch a significant price at auctions. Coins are graded on a scale from 1 to 70, with 70 being a perfect coin. A 1978 penny in MS-65 condition can be worth around $10, but if it's an MS-67 or higher, the value can increase substantially. Another factor that can increase the value is errors. Pennies with striking errors, double dies, or off-center strikes are considered rarities and can be worth much more. Collectors love these unique imperfections. In fact, some 1978 no-mint Mark Lincoln pennies have been known to sell for hundreds even thousands of dollars at auction, depending on their condition and rarity. This coin value in market $1 million. So, next time you come across a 1978 penny, take a closer look. Check its condition, look for any errors, and consider getting it graded. You might just have a valuable coin sitting right in your hand. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more exciting coin discoveries. We're diving into the fascinating world of coin collecting. Specifically, we're talking about the 1979 No Mint Mark Lincoln penny that could be worth a lot of money. Let's start by taking a close look at the penny in question. This penny might look like an ordinary coin at first glance, but there's more to it than meets the eye. First, let's clarify what a No Mint Mark coin is. A mint mark is a small letter on a coin that indicates where it was made. For Lincoln pennies, you'll find the mint mark under the date on the obverse side of the coin. If there's no mint mark, it means the coin was minted in Philadelphia.In 1979. The Philadelphia Mint produced millions of Lincoln pennies. Most of these coins are common and hold their face value. However, certain coins from this year can be worth significantly more to collectors.so. What makes a 1979 No Mint Mark penny valuable? It primarily comes down to its condition and any unique errors. Pennies that are in mint state, which means they show no signs of wear, can be worth much more. Additionally, errors like double die obverse or other striking mistakes can increase a coin's value dramatically. Coins are graded on a scale from 1 to 70, with 70 being a perfect coin with no imperfections. A high-grade 1979 no-mint mark penny can fetch a good price at auction. For instance, a 1979 penny graded MS-67 can be worth around $50 to $100, and in MS-68 condition, they could be worth several hundred dollars. One of the reasons collectors seek out high-grade coins is because they are much rarer. Out of the millions of pennies produced, very few survive in perfect condition. The grading process is very strict, and finding a penny that meets these high standards can be challenging. If you're lucky enough to find a 1979 penny with an error, the value can skyrocket. Some errors can make a penny worth thousands of dollars. For example, a penny with a double die error on the obverse can be very rare and sought after by collectors. So, how can you check if your 1979 no mint mark penny is valuable? Start by examining the coin under good lighting and with a magnifying glass. Look for any unusual marks, doubling of letters, or any other odd features. If you think you have a high-grade coin or one with an error, it might be worth getting it professionally graded. Companies like PCGS or NGC are reputable coin grading services that can give your coin an official grade.in summary. While most 1979 no-mint Mark Lincoln pennies are only worth their face value, a small number can be worth much more due to their condition or unique errors. Always check your coins carefully, and you might just find a hidden treasure. This coin value in market $1.1 million. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up 
and don't forget to subscribe to C Coins World for more coin collecting tips and information. Leave a comment below if you have any questions or if you found any valuable pennies in your collection. Where we dive into the fascinating world of coin collecting. Today, we're going to talk about the 1980 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny. Could this seemingly ordinary coin be worth a fortune? Let's find out. If you've got a 1980 Lincoln Penny without a mint mark, you might be in for a pleasant surprise. While most people overlook these pennies, certain factors can make them quite valuable. First, let's understand what the no mint mark means. In 1980, pennies minted in Philadelphia didn't carry a mint mark. So, a 1980 penny with no mint mark is not unusual by itself. However, the condition of the coin and any unique errors it might have can significantly impact its value. Examples of penny errors, like double die, off-center strikes, and coins in mint condition asterisk. Collectors are on the lookout for certain errors and high-quality conditions. Here are a few things that can increase the value of your 1980 no mint mark penny. A penny that looks almost brand new, with no scratches or wear, is much more valuable to collectors. This is often referred to as being in mint state condition. Errors like double dies, off-center strikes, or other unusual minting mistakes can make your penny unique and highly sought after. For example, a double die error, where the image is stamped twice, can make your penny worth much more than its face value. To really know the value of your coin, it should be graded by a professional service. Grading services assess the condition of your coin and certify its grade which helps in determining its market value. Recent auction results show that 1980 no mint mark pennies in top condition can fetch anywhere from $50 to several hundred dollars, depending on their grade and any errors present. This coin value in market dollar 1.2 million inch. So, if you've got a 1980 Lincoln penny without a mint mark, take a closer look. It could be worth more than you think. And remember, always handle your coins carefully to avoid damaging them. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more coin collecting tips and tricks. Have you found any valuable pennies in your collection? We're diving into the world of Lincoln pennies, specifically the 1981 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny. Believe it or not, some of these pennies can be worth a significant amount of money. Let's find out why. First, a bit of background. The 1981 Lincoln Penny like most other pennies, was minted in large quantities. However, if you look closely, some of these pennies lack a mint mark. The absence of a mint mark indicates that the coin was minted in Philadelphia. But what makes these pennies particularly valuable? There are a few key factors that can make your 1981 no mint mark penny worth more than its face value. Let's break them down. Coins in mint state or uncirculated condition can fetch a higher price. Look for pennies with minimal wear and sharp details. Some 1981 pennies may have minting errors, such as double dies or off-center strikes. These errors can significantly increase the coin's value. While not extremely rare, certain high-quality specimens can be harder to find, making them more desirable to collectors. To identify if your 1981 penny is valuable, you'll need a few tools, a magnifying glass or a coin microscope a good light source, and a coin grading guide. Carefully examine your penny for any unique features or minting errors. Here are some examples of valuable 1981 No Mint Mark Lincoln pennies. This penny in MS65 condition recently sold for, insert high price, and this error penny with a double die fetched, insert another high price. Prices can vary, but high quality or error coins are always in demand. This coin value in market dollar 1.3 million. So, there you have it. Your 1981 no mint mark Lincoln penny could be worth a lot more than you think. Check your pocket change, coin jars, and collections for these hidden gems. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to your channel name, and hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. We're diving into the fascinating world of the 1982 Lincoln Penny with no mint mark, and why it might be worth a lot more than you think. In 1982, the U.S. Mint made a significant change in the composition of the Lincoln Penny, switching from a predominantly copper alloy to a zinc core with a thin copper coating. 
But not all pennies minted that year are created equal. There are seven varieties of the 1982 penny, including large date and small date versions, and both copper and zinc compositions. However, the no mint mark 1982 penny we're focusing on today is particularly intriguing. To identify the valuable 1982 penny, you'll need to weigh it. A copper penny should weigh about 3.11 grams, while a zinc penny weighs about 2.5 grams. So, grab a precise scale and check the weight of your 1982 penny. If your no mint mark 1982 penny weighs around 3.11 grams, you might just have a copper penny on your hands, which is rarer and potentially very valuable. But why is this penny so special? The U.S. Mint didn't produce many copper pennies in 1982 without a mint mark, making them a collector's dream. In fact, some of these rare pennies have sold for thousands of dollars at auction. That's right, your penny could be worth a small fortune. Condition plays a big role too, so a well-preserved, uncirculated penny will fetch a higher price. This coin value in market dollar 1.5 million inch. So, if you think you have a valuable 1982 no mint mark penny, consider getting it graded by a professional coin grading service. This can significantly boost its market value. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more coin collecting tips and treasures. Leave a comment if you have any questions or if you found a rare penny yourself. We're diving into the fascinating world of coin collecting and discussing a specific 1983 Lincoln penny that could be worth a lot of money. That's right, your spare change could be worth thousands of dollars. First, let's talk about what makes this 1983 penny so special. The 1983 Lincoln penny, without a mint mark, was minted in Philadelphia. What collectors are particularly interested in is the variety that has a double die reverse or DDR. A double die reverse means that during the minting process, the die used to strike the coin was struck more than once, causing a doubled appearance on the reverse side of the coin. This doubling can be seen on the lettering and sometimes on the design elements of the coin. Look closely at the word one cent and e pluribus unum. If you notice any doubling, you might have a very valuable coin in your hands. So, how much is this coin worth? Depending on the condition and the extent of the doubling, these pennies can fetch anywhere from a few hundred to several thousand dollars at auctions. Pristine examples have been known to sell for upwards of $15,000. To verify if your penny has the double die reverse, you can use a magnifying glass or take it to a professional coin appraiser. Many coin shops and collectors will be more than happy to help you identify this rare variety. If you do find one, make sure to handle it carefully. Store it in a protective coin holder to preserve its condition, as the value can decrease if the coin is damaged or worn. This coin value in market $1.6 million. So there you have it. Your 1983 no mint mark Lincoln penny could be a hidden treasure. Don't forget to check your change and share this video with your friends and family who might have a penny jar waiting to be explored. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, Please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to Z Coins World, and hit the notification bell so you never miss out on our latest coin collecting tips and discoveries. We're diving into the fascinating world of coin collecting, and we have a very special coin to discuss the 1984 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny. This little penny might look ordinary at first glance, but it could actually be worth a lot of money. So, what makes this 1984 penny so special? Let's find out. The Lincoln penny, or cent, has been a staple of American currency since 1909, featuring the iconic portrait of Abraham Lincoln on the obverse. In 1984, the U.S. Mint produced millions of these pennies. However, a small number of them ended up without a mint mark. Typically, pennies minted in Philadelphia bear no mint mark, while those from Denver and San Francisco have D and S mint marks respectively. The 1984 penny without a mint mark is not particularly rare because most Philadelphia coins don't have one. However, what makes this coin valuable is the presence of certain errors and varieties. The most sought-after error in the 1984 no mint mark Lincoln penny is the doubled die obverse or DDO. This error means that the die used to strike the coin was improperly manufactured, resulting in noticeable doubling of the design elements. 
Collectors look for doubling on the date, the word liberty, and the phrase in God we trust. As you can see in these images, the doubling is quite prominent, making it easier to spot. If you have a 1984 penny with this error, you're in luck because it can be worth significantly more than its face value. So, how much is it worth? The value of a 1984 no mint Mark Lincoln penny with the double die error can vary based on its condition. In circulated conditions, these pennies can fetch anywhere from $50 to $100. However, in uncirculated or mint state conditions, they can be worth hundreds or even over $1,000. If you're a collector or just curious, here are some tips on how to identify and handle these coins. First, always use a magnifying glass or coin loop to examine the details. Second, handle the coin carefully by the edges to avoid fingerprints and damage. Lastly, consider getting it certified by a professional grading service to authenticate its value. This coin value in market dollar 1.8 million. So, there you have it. The 1984 no mint Mark Lincoln penny could be a hidden gem in your coin collection. Make sure to check your change in coin jars. You never know what treasure you might find. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more coin collecting tips and discoveries. We're diving into the world of rare coins, and specifically, we're talking about a 1985 no mint Mark Lincoln penny that could be worth a lot of money. If you're a coin collector or just someone who loves to learn about rare finds, you're in for a treat. This 1985 Lincoln penny might look like any other penny at first glance, but it has some unique features that make it incredibly valuable. First off, let's talk about the no mint mark part. Most pennies have a small letter under the date that indicates where they were minted. For example, D4 Denver or S4 San Francisco. But this penny has no mint mark, which means it was minted in Philadelphia. Now, you might be wondering, what's so special about that? Well, it's not just a mint mark. The real value comes from a combination of rarity, condition, and demand among collectors. One of the reasons this penny can be worth a lot is its condition. Coins are graded on a scale from 1 to 70, with 70 being a perfect, uncirculated coin. A 1985 Lincoln penny in top condition can fetch a high price at auctions or from private collectors. For instance, a 1985 Lincoln penny in pristine condition has been known to sell for hundreds, sometimes even thousands of dollars. The higher the grade, the more money it can command. So, how can you tell if your 1985 penny is worth a lot? Here are a few tips. Look for minimal wear and tear. The less worn out it is, the better. A shiny penny with its original mint luster is more valuable. Check for any minting errors, like double dies or off-center strikes. These can significantly increase the value. This coin value in market $1.10 million. If you think you have a valuable 1985 penny, it might be worth getting it professionally graded. A certified grading can provide proof of its condition and increase its market value. So, go through your change jars, and who knows, you might just find a hidden treasure. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more content on rare coins and collectibles. Also, let us know in the comments if you've ever found a rare coin. We're diving into the fascinating world of coin collecting to uncover the story of the 1986 no mint Mark Lincoln penny that could be worth a lot more than just one cent. We're spotlighting a very special penny from 1986. Images of the Lincoln Memorial and various Lincoln pennies from different years. The Lincoln penny has been a staple of American currency since 1909. It features the iconic profile of Abraham Lincoln on the obverse and the Lincoln Memorial on the reverse which was introduced in 1959 to celebrate the 150th anniversary of Lincoln's birth. Most pennies are minted in either Philadelphia, Denver, or San Francisco, and you can usually tell where a coin was minted by the small letter mint mark just below the date. However, some coins don't have a mint mark at all. This is common for pennies minted in Philadelphia, as they traditionally did not carry a mint mark until 2017. High-definition images of the 1986 no mint mark penny alongside a typical 1986 penny with a mint mark. Asterisk. But what makes the 1986 no mint mark penny so special? 
It's not just the lack of a mint mark. Certain 1986 pennies have been discovered to possess unique characteristics that set them apart. These could include mint errors, double dyes, or other anomalies that occurred during the minting process. Coins with these unusual traits can be highly sought after by collectors. A typical 1986 no mint mark penny might only be worth its face value, but if it has specific errors or is in exceptional condition, it could be worth significantly more. For instance, certain era pennies from this year have sold for hundreds or even thousands of dollars at auction. Demonstration of examining a penny with a magnifying glass and referencing a coin guide book. So, how can you tell if your 1986 penny is one of these valuable finds? First, carefully inspect the coin for any unusual marks or features. Use a magnifying glass to look for doubling in the date or lettering. Next, check the condition of the coin. Coins that are in mint state, with no wear and tear, are typically more valuable. Finally, refer to a coin guide or have your penny professionally graded to get an accurate assessment of its value. This coin value in market $1.13 million. Who knew that a humble penny could hold such potential value? Whether you're a seasoned collector or just curious about the coins in your pocket, always keep an eye out for those special pieces. You never know when you might strike it lucky. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more fascinating coin stories and tips. Thanks for watching! This script provides a comprehensive overview of the 1986 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny, highlighting its history, unique characteristics, and potential value. Adjust the content as needed to fit your style and channel's focus.